death row prisoner number 541. You have a visitor. Please make this a short visit, ma'am. The priest will be here any minute to give the prisoner his last meal and his last cigarette. Oops, I forgot. No cigarettes for you, 541. You've been banned from ever looking at matches, remember? Byron was feeling very sad. He didn't say anything to me. He didn't even give me a dirty look. That made me a lot braver. When she saw his hair, Joetta's eyes got real big and her voice got all choky. Byron Watson, what were you thinking about? Look at your head. Daddy's going to kill you. Come down from there. Let's go to the bathroom and wash that stuff out of your hair before Daddy gets here. Byron raised his slick down head from his hands. Go away, Joey. Come on, Byron. We got to wash your hair till that junk comes out. Hurry. Joetta pulled on Byron's dangling legs. Stop, Joey, he finally said. This don't wash out. It's got to grow out. You mean you have to keep it like that until it comes back normal? Yeah, Byron said, kind of smiling. They can't do nothing to it till it grows back. Oh, no. Daddy's going to tear you up. I said, that's right, ma'am. 541 is just waiting for the executioner to get home. Would you like to stick around and write down his last words? Joey turned and snapped. Why is this so funny to you, Kenny? Her eyes looked real mean. Who knows what daddy's going to do to him? Byron's ham hands came back up to cover his face. I said to Joey, why are you yelling at me? It wasn't me who went and got a butter, and no one forced him to do it either. It makes me sick the way she's always protecting Byron. She turned back to him. Who did this to you, By? She didn't have to ask. There was only one other 14-year-old in the neighborhood who had a conch. I answered for him. It was Bubhead. Why'd you let him, Bye? I told you to go away, Joey. No, Byron. Why'd you let him do this? Because I wanted to. That's why. But didn't you know Mommy and Daddy would find out? Shoot, you think I care what them squares say? I said, and there you have it, ma'am. The reason 541 must die. He won't confess his guilt. Byron looked at me for the first time, and I started easing toward the door. He said, you think I don't know what you're doing, punk? You think I don't know you're loving all this mess? <laughs>